Good evening. Tell me your opinions on history there. And history, to me, it's a load of crap. You're better off sitting down, have a few beers, look at the sunset. Ah, look at the sun in my eyes. It's absolutely wonderful. <laughs> so, yep, I spent the day doing those later modern predictions. Very, very dull political history course. But um, we have them done anyway for the higher level. Now, I don't think I have the patience to, to do them for the ordinary level as well, or the perseverance, but sure. I might, I might do them and see how we go. But sure, I'll give you what we've got anyway, right? So having gone through these courses, the most popular topics I think are Irish Topic 3, um, Europe Topic 3 and Europe Topic 6. They're the three that I've done anyway. I think that your most likely topic to come up for Ireland Topic 3 would be the social and economic changes in Northern Ireland after World War II. Um, secondly, the Anglo-Irish Treaty, Patrick Pierce, Horrick Pierce, we should say, is your third most likely topic. Fourth most likely, it's under the stone here. What the fuck? Um, oh yeah, Sinn Féin in the 1918 election, their success in the 1918 election, and finally, Belfast, just after World War II, during and after World War II. So then you have the European topics. Europe topic three, all about Hitler and the Nazis and the whole lot. It's probably one of the better topics uh, on the later modern course, but it still has all that political crap in it, so I can't say I'm the biggest fan of it. Um, your most likely topic to come up there is that one, the Jarrow March, October 1936, and that will probably tie in with this element as well, the social and economic cha challenges that faced England at the time. So there's your big one, the Jarrow March, tied in with the social and economic challenges facing England. That's the big one. Second most likely one is the impact of World War II on the civilians in England. Um, third most likely is characteristics of Nazi Germany. Fourth most likely one is propaganda. Propaganda uh, surrounding World War II. And finally, the Soviet Union during World War II. That brings us to the last topic, American history, which is Europe topic six, like why it's included in Europe. I suppose it's Europe and the wider world, so they can get away with it. Your most likely topic there is McCarthyism. McCarthyism. Second most likely, the civil rights agitation and racial conflict. Third most likely, the Vietnam War. Fourth most likely is the American dream. And finally, sure, we may as well throw in old Ronald Reagan as the fifth. Brings back childhood memories, does Ronald. For me, anyway. Probably not for any of ye, because you're probably all born in the 1990s. Ho, ho, ho. Yeah. So basically, it's all in the past, yeah? Which is, of course. Live, 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 live for now. This is history now. This is history. Just finished the ordinary level later modern history predictions. You may have noticed that the higher level ones were finished by sunset today, which is around about 9 o'clock. It's now... what was it? Oh yeah, it's late enough. Come up to 10 past 2. Uh, right, and it's tomorrow is Sunday, so that's when I have to be uploaded by. Right, the ordinary level topics. For the document-based question, it will be either Coleraine, or The Apprentice Boys. Um, for Irish Topic 3, our most likely topic to come up is Countess Markovic. Uh, then, the Anglo-Irish Treaty and Negotiations. Thirdly is the 1916 Rising, it's very likely. And then you have um, the Eucharistic Congress 1932, or maybe Arthur Griffith, or the War of Independence, or the effects of World War II on Belfast. They said most likely topics there. In Europe topic 3, about dictatorship, your most likely topic is Mussolini, then uh, Goebbels and prop prop Nazi propaganda, 
thirdly, you have the Vichy State in France. Then Stalin's show trials. Charlie Chaplin or Bing Crosby, whichever one you prefer. Um, then you might get the advances in the technology of warfare. And final topic here is Winston Churchill. They're the seven topics I have for you in that section. Now, in Europe topic six, the America one, I have another seven topics for you here. And they are in order of preference, uh, well, of likelihood. The most likely thing you're gonna get is Billy Graham. Um, secondly would be the Vietnam War. Thirdly, where the fuck is it? Uh, the Civil Rights Movement. Uh, probably not focusing on the bus boycott. Marilyn Monroe is likely. So is the moon landing. Uh, so is Harold S. Truman. And finally, youth culture in the U.S. of A. And people just say, oh my God, wasn't that great? So historic in those days. Bullshit! <laughs> I was feeling for you Take a look at me now It's all over What I was feeling before It's no good anymore You tell